me quarter to three and I've been back since about maybe half past and so I've been back about half, since about half past twelve really and um, yeah I'm just finishing uploading my yesterday vlog and I don't, I don't know if people are going to say about this but one of my favourite all time films is How to Train Your Dragon and I love it for example which is like the, my like most favourite thing in my bedroom is my toothless teddy bear and I don't even care <laughs> and um, basically they have a series on Netflix called Race to the Edge I love it <laughs> and I've just got a notification on my phone saying they've got the new series out so I've made a new fan of Sims and Family and I've been with quite like a posh kind of Sims just like two I've got Mandy and Adam I think and um yes yeah, so I'm just gonna play with those and I'm gonna watch the new season of How to Train Dragon as well which I'm really excited for because it, le it ended on a cliffhanger last time and I really wanna know what happened so I might have, so I might watch the last episode in the previous season and then watch the next season so I'm, I'm gonna do that now and chill I'm so tired and I'm so cold as well I've got myself a mug should put and I've got my dressing gown on it's so cold I had my window shut I don't understand why it's so cold today but it's honestly and me and my mum also went to New Look and I finally got the top I wanted which is this one yes I just say she has the same top but I love any of the clothes she wears I just love and if they're cheap then <laughs> so it's, it's basically like a long sleeve t-shirt orange with black stripes and black and white stripes and it's got like these really cute ruffles on like the bottom and the sleeves it's so cute and this was only how much is it? Twelve pound. And I also got a scarf, a really big looking scarf, because I've only got the one that my stepmom made me. But I've had that for so long, like it's kind of like falling apart. So I was like, oh, get you a new one if you're gonna use it. But it's huge. I don't know how big it is. Mm. <laughs> it's huge. And this was originally uh, thirteen pound down to four pound fifty. So that was my mum was like, oh, I'll get you it if you really want it. And I was like, yeah, go on then. And I've come and brought it back to its original position. I don't want to watch that one, I want to watch the other one first. How do you change it? Oh, there we go. Season 6, 5, Brie. And then go down. Is it going to work or not? Put that one on. Hello. I have to go to. Oh, what were we then? I was on a thing. Again, not the one I clicked on. <sighs> God. <laughs> Netflix work, please. There we go. Let's watch the last episode of season 5 and then we can move on to season 6. So me and Mum just popped out again to go get some KFC, which I'm very excited about. So I'm going to show you guys the thing I always get in my KFC <laughs> drink wise I get my favourite thing in the world and that is the Skittles Crush em because I love them and I just genuinely love it. I get the boneless banquet and in the boneless banquet you get <sighs> I forgot my barbecue sauce Disgrace. that's annoying me <laughs> so you get basically get you get your chips and then you get your gravy, you get your chicken, popcorn chicken, which I'll try and open with one hand, there you go, popcorn chicken, I don't think you can see it, there you go, <laughs> and then you get your fillets, which are really good as well, 
And just to try something new, I've also, my mum's just given me two of these. They're like barbecue pieces of chicken. I don't understand why they are completely. I'm gonna try them in a minute and I'm really excited because I'm really hungry. I'm gonna have to take my jumper because I'm really hot. And I'm on episode three, I think it is, of the How to Train Your Dragon um, Race at the Edge. I love it. This season is so good. <laughs> Basically, like, the person who you've known throughout all the seasons, who's been helping you, has turned out to be against you the whole time. And you're just like... And it basically goes back and shows you all the different ways that he's done it. And I was like, wow. <laughs> and I'm still playing Sims as well, so I'm eating, watching, and playing. Just having some kitty cuddles. We're having kitty cuddles. We're having kitty cuddles. <laughs> She's being so... I look so red. She's being so needy this afternoon. Hey. Like, I finished my KFC, I ate all of it, and I feel like I stuffed chicken on Christmas Day. Fun. And then, like, I opened my door to go out, to take my tray out. She ran in. <laughs> like, got my room, she got the hallway, and then you've got, like, my door, and then you've got my room. She literally ran around the corner, went under my bedside, like, thinking I was going to tell her to, like, get out or something. And then she just wanted to cuddle you. But she's actually being so needy. I just heard the weirdest sound. I don't know if you guys can hear it. There's an ice cream van in February. I haven't heard that noise for months. And they don't even come around my area. And I can hear an ice cream van. And it's really loud a minute ago. And I'm just really confused. Like, it's 10 to 6. It's dark. And there's an ice cream van going around. That sounds normal, isn't it? So, I've just finished filming a video on this makeup look. Which will be up on Monday. So, this video goes up on a Saturday. So, the Monday coming will be this tutorial on, my, on this channel that you're on right now. So make sure you're subscribed in order to see it. I did eyeliner and I'm pretty damn happy with it. Although it didn't go as well as I planned. I've got something. Oh, it's just a bit dark. Um, it didn't go as well as I hoped. Like, I it took me about ages to sort it out. But I got there eventually. And now I'm just trying to get a photo for my Instagram. And yeah, I know I haven't really done a lot today, but... Like, there's nothing really I could have vlogged. So this pro this vlog is probably going to be, like, less than 10 minutes long, probably. I'm not I wouldn't be surprised. But I would admit, all the other days have been really good. And I've had, like, two chill days. So it's all good, I think. I'm, like, so shocked right now. I've, I, I've just finished season six already of the, um, of the Race to the Edge. And the ending. If any of you have seen the first two films, then... The last episode of season six had a lot of references to it. So it had like a, like two episodes, I think it was before. Stoic was in like something where he nearly died. Then you had the... I can't remember what it's called. But the big white dragon at the end of the first one. No, the second one. Um, he's the king of dragons. And you see him at the end of the episode. And there's like this big fight this is like this little fight in that and then his egg is being protected by hiccup's mum who you've never seen in the series and like it's just had so many references and actually there's another one turns out the people that like the dragon hunters had one big leader and it turns out it was drago bloodfist who's like the main villain in the second in the second movie and I was just like, I basic, I basically gasped harder than I ever had before, and I nearly died. <laughs> but oh my god, I, I have to wait till next year for season seven if there's even gonna be a season seven. Because the thing is, I think they're kind of um doing it is like a series version of the film because like obviously all those references. 
and like but i think they, they're changing it a little bit but oh my god i'm so happy with that i love that and that was that is probably season six is probably my favorite season to be honest if any of you are like me and just love like cartoons and that and just like anything like adorable then honestly watch this so yeah i don't know what i'm gonna watch now i've got nothing else to watch now. i might watch friends now to be honest although i have got to tidy up <laughs> I've been too busy watching How to Train Your Dragon. I haven't tidied up anything yet from when I filmed. But oh my god, I'm just so like shocked with that ending. Mum was it it says season one, episode one, I might start it all again to be honest, just because I love this program so much. But oh my god, I'm so like you know when something really like it's like when something really really, really like you're like wow at the end of a season. I'm like that right now, like oh my god. <sighs> That's sick. Yeah, I'm probably gonna watch Friends now. But Friends has gone really weird at the moment. Like, I think her name's Rachel. I still don't know the names properly. And I'm on episode 21. I'm on episode 21 on season one. And Rachel. So hang on, let me get this straight. Rachel's husband cheated on Rachel before with Rachel's best friend. And then when Rachel's ex husband. Was he about to get married to Rachel's best friend? She, he cheated on her with Rachel. I think, like, that is a very good plot twist. And I know, obviously, I know what happens mostly. I know Ross and Rachel get together, I think. And Monica and Chandler get together, I think. And then Phoebe marries some other guy. And, um, I can't remember what his name is. The other one, Ross. No, it's Ross, Chandler. Oh God, the other one, apparently he doesn't end up with anyone or something. But I'm really excited. For, I'm really glad I've started watching this. And to be honest, like, I think that series has just made my day. I believe I've got about a year till it comes back again. If it comes back again, I'm not even sure if there is a season seven. I'm gonna do some research and see if there is a season seven because I want to blim in now because there was a wedding and everything. <sighs> I hate this is why this is why I hate watching series. I hate cliffhangers. Well, I like cliffhangers, but I hate having to wait a really long time in order to see what happens next. Like once upon a time, well, I'm probably not gonna watch it because it's absolutely rubbish now. But oh my god. I can't wait to watch season 7 now. <laughs>